Oh, Jeff, you really are kind of a tool head, aren't you? I mean, really. Uh, I'll acknowledge that, that I jumped the gun on the whole text um, deleting my, like my text comments. I jumped the gun on that. However, um, you never respond to me. Except in a case like this, when you think somehow that I'm going to say, oh, yoke up, you're right, and I'm all wrong, praise Jeebus. Come on, man. No. I might have been wrong about that, and I will acknowledge that. However, through two videos now, I have made a single assertion um, in relation to your insistence that this war in Iraq, this illegal war, this unholy war in Iraq, your insistence that this war is divine and that this war is correct. You're probably one of those people that has that, has that ridiculous notion that, that all this is, is foaming up to Armageddon. Yeah, yeah, the, the final battle. I, I just, I, you've not actually said that, and if I'm putting words in your mouth, then, then correct me as you seem to think you, you can. Um, but that, that this, the general tone, because folks like you, evangelicals like you, that's the twist you put on it. It's the same twist that y'all put on the Cold War in the 80s. How'd that work out? The whole eagle and the bear thing in, in, in the Revelation and, and how back in the 80s. Remember the 80s? Back in the 80s, um, the eagle was the United States and, and the, the bear was the, the Soviet Union and that that was going to bring on Armageddon. Those godless, atheistic, communist, socialist bastards, those pinko commie assholes, or whatever. That didn't work out either, and neither is this one. Because even your Bible, the one that you, that you claim to know so well, even your Bible says, states, that no one will know the hour, no one will know the day. Breaks down the whole theory. Also, the thing that I, that I said throughout those two videos, the past two videos, that in order for this war to be divinely uh, supported, that God had to be either, uh, had to be an ignorant, drunk, and autocrat, that was one video. And then this most recent video, that in order for this to be a divinely supported war, that God had to be a sadist. Two things I said that you're not responding to, but you want to pick on the little text thing, fine. I'm sorry, yoke up. But I am not apologizing for anything else that I said. You clearly didn't pay attention to anything else that I said, which is not unusual, because um, you don't pay attention to anybody. Um, still not going away. And, uh, I will, I, will, I will say, though, that, that uh, I like that, that uh, Caroline, at least, um, seems to be more the, the more honest of the two of you. I made a comment on, uh, on, your, on your, uh, your video that all this ties back to about uh, how basically you're saying that it's un-American, that we're being un-American if we don't support the troops in the war. Um, because Amy Booth, one of your, I guess, one of your, your vast defenders, or a, a, a shadow account that you're using, um, tried to say that that's not what you were saying. Caroline, I give you props because at least you are honest. I have way more respect for you than I do that guy that you're hitched to. So, yeah, that's as close to an apology as you're going to ever get from me because you have not once bothered to respond to me. Um, and I realize that there are probably infinitely more important things to do, but I would think that with your you know, evangelical desires with, to be a minister, that you would at least try. But all right, you're not really a minister. You're just looking for people to agree with you. Ha! Sorry. <laughs>